We've talked about them, the proud Penn State Nittany Lion, our tale of the tape for this featherweight matchup, Dublin, Ireland's Sinead K.O. Kavanaugh. You can look at 32 to 24. Janae is a young fighter. She's got the longer reach. We'll see if Sinead can get inside of that. All right, here's Michael C. Williams. And now, ladies and gentlemen, inside the Bellator cage, we go three five-minute rounds in the featherweight division. Introducing the blue corner first at five foot ten, weighing in 145 pounds even. Her professional record stands at three and four. She fights out of Sydney by way of Gold Coast, Australia. Janae Hollowpoint Hardy. And across the cage, her adversary out of the red corner at five foot seven, weighing in the same 145 pounds even as a professional. She brings five victories, two losses. She fights out of Dublin, Ireland, presenting Sinead Cahill Kavanaugh. In charge of the action, referee Kevin McDonald. Kevin McDonald, our referee, KO had the TKO. At home in Dublin in her last fight, John, it took just 31 seconds against Maria Casanova. Yeah, that was a fast one, and she hit her with a big right. shot, put her down. Right. Casanova. Go. Fight clock tonight, brought to you by Miller Lite. Great taste, and only 96 calories. Born in New Zealand, fighting out of Gold Coast, Australia, Janae Harding in the blue gloves, Kavanaugh in the red gloves, letting her hands go early. And this is what I think Sinead needs to do. She has to get after Janae early, and if Janae is able to weather that storm and bring this fight into the later rounds, that is her best chance of winning this fight. Janae Kavanaugh training out of SBG Ireland, of course, under John Kavanaugh. Paul McConnor McGregor, James Gallagher, Chris Fields, Gunnar Nelson, Charlie Ward, and company. So Nate started out as a boxer, and she does have good boxing. She won several national titles in the amateurs in Ireland with her boxing, and she does hit hard. If she can get rid of hollow point fast, that's the way she wins this fight. But Janae hangs tough. She showed that in her last fight, and if she can just weather the early storm, I think she's got a good chance of doing something tonight a lot of people don't think she has the skill to do. Kavanaugh, five-time Irish national champion in her 10 years of boxing that you talked about, Big John. Very difficult, she said, though, uh, to go professional in Ireland as a woman. Not a lot of opportunities, so she made her way to MMA, and this is her fifth Bellator fight. Second here in the U.S. She's in the red gloves, blue gloves for... Janae Harding, who went the distance in San Jose back in May in her Bellator debut. And Sinead's not giving a lot of respect to Janae, but Janae's doing a lot of good things, a lot of good movement. She's covering well. She's not taking that big shot, and she's responding. Look at the elbows inside. She's doing things to cause Sinead a problem, and she's already got a cut on her face. She's long, too, as you talked about. She is. She's a good fighter. Her last fight against Le Lybrock, man, she just took too many shots early in the fight. She got it into that third round, and she did a great job in it, but she got worn down by the early shots. And her early setbacks of her career have all been against experienced mixed martial artists. You're exactly right. You look at the people that she has fought, you know, people like Jessica Rose Clark, you know, Arlene Blanco. She's, she is, you know, she fought Megan Anderson in the Emmys. She has had a murderer's row as far as a young fighter. And she has bloodied up Sinead Kavanaugh. Big cut over the right eye of KO. And that came from that big left elbow that she threw against the fence. Harding out of Tiger Muay Thai. Roger Huerta, we saw him a couple weeks ago. Fighting in Boise. So you know she's got some sharp elbows and she's already put them on display. Harding in the blue, Kavanaugh in the red. And these women are going after it. She tried to land another one, got her arm caught inside. Now she's pressed against the fence. But Janae Harding is landing some really effective shots. She's weathering that storm. And she is she's doing everything she's supposed to do in this fight to win. Seven professional fights for Kavanaugh. She has never been stopped. 
right there. Took the position, turned it around. She was the one that landed the knee strike off of the clinch. I mean, in fighting Arlene Blenko, you're talking about someone who fought for the featherweight world title. Against our champion, Julia Budd. Later on tonight, 9 Eastern, 8 Central, semifinal number one, Matt Mitrione, Ryan Bader. That is our main event. Don't forget, big country boy Nelson, Sergey Karatanov, Lorenz Larkin, and Ion Pascu. The winner of that welterweight fight will become the alternate in the tournament, plus Baby Slice, all tonight, live and free on Paramount. I really like what I'm seeing out of Janae as far as her movement. She's changing head level. She's doing a lot of good things. She, her kicks, sometimes she's bringing her foot up at a time that maybe she shouldn't. But man, overall, big elbow strike. Good left hand landed by Sinead off the two. 30 seconds remains here in this first round, and it's been a good one. This has been a competitive round. Both girls are going after it. Over the top. Harding with good movements, which is stands back and forth. Look at those nice straight shots yeah. those, Mike. Good first round. Very good first round. Competitive. Tending to the cut over the right eye of Kavanaugh. Take your time. Take your time. Your job is beautiful. Keep back here with the job. Listen, you Janae, see, look at the no, shots. One, two. One, two. Nice oh, elbow. Oh, that one is not the one that cut her on the forehead. That one landed the cheek. Boom. That's the one that cut her right there. You can see that elbow strike. All those elbow strikes inside, those are hard. They hurt. All of a sudden, because you don't see it, Mike. And it rolls over. You don't see the shot like you see the punch coming. Keep her on the backhand with the jab. Pretty hit a cut. That's a good one. That's going to leave a mark. Did that yeah, panel? You beat me to it. <laughs> yep. Time. But it's your 60th birthday, so. Yeah. Well, Not no, a lot to treat after this thing's up. I appreciate you that. I got you. Okay? <laughs> Thanks. We should have a Twitter contest. How old you really are. Exactly. Until somebody goes on Wikipedia and figures it out. <laughs> Happy 56th birthday, partner. Thank you very it's much, over. partner. I appreciate it. <laughs> oh, they're calling this wow. fight, Mike. And Sinead is saying, is it that bad? And you know what? It is still bleeding. It's Not quite Marvin Eastman, but I'm going to tell you, and look, at this is the problem with this. You have a cut man right now. Paulie is the cut man inside of the cage. The doctor should allow the cut man to work on that cut for the full 60 seconds so he can show him exactly how bad the cut will be. If you don't give him the full 60 seconds to work on it, he can make it better. And so it could be a better cut than you think, and it's not in a place where, yes, it's going to bleed into her eye. That's what he's concerned with. But if the cut man can stop it, let him have the time to stop it. Well. The reason it was stopped is because of what you just said, John. It is above the eye, thus the blood would come down into the eye. Yes. If it were underneath, we'd be fighting still. Yep, that's the whole difference is look at the doctors looking and saying, I don't want a fighter going out there with one eye. Yes. So disappointment for Sinead Kavanaugh. Stopped for the first time in a professional career by a very sharp elbow thrown by that young lady, 24-year-old Janae Hardin. Going back, there's the elbow. You see it just slide by, but it, when it slides, what happens is that elbow is pressing the skin against the skull, and it actually splits from the inside out. That's the way that that is going to end up causing the cut. It's not one that you looked at the shot was that hard, but it's the way the elbow lands as it slices through, it presses that skin, and that's what we end up with. Michael C. Williams to make it official. 
Ladies and gentlemen, upon the advice of the cage side physician, referee Kevin McDonald waves off the contest due to the cut official time. Is five minutes of round number one for the winner by TKO Janae Halapon.